in this video it's the second Edinburgh derby of the season as we head to Hearts then we'll take on Kilmarnock at home and we'll wrap it up with a match against Falkirk. Edinburgh home of royalty culture and tradition it's also home of two classic Scottish clubs but there's only room for one of them welcome to the pride of Edinburgh so the first match in this video is the second Edinburgh derby of the season. Obviously, we will have the bragging rights thus far, the 3-0 win at Easter Row, but this time, it's at Tynecastle, Hearts versus Hibs. So starting 11 for this match, Ladlaw, Whitaker, Hanlon, Erkstrom, Ambrose, McGinn, Ejara, Silverka, Swanson, Boyle, and Murray, our hosts. So start with the 4-4-2. Let's do it. Hearts kick us off at a rainy Tynecastle. My next opponent, Ross County, currently holding St. Johnston 0 0. Ladlaw with a big pick out. Boots this out towards Murray. Ajara now has it. Swanson with a long distance effort. Doesn't amount to much. Here come Hearts now. Minklevich. Big effort, big shot. No trouble. Edging towards the half time. And here's Hearts coming now, counter attacking. Here's right, Kasalak, Bera, Miklovic for right. Oh, he went for goal. If he'd spot his colleague up there, I'm sure Hearts will be going in at half time, 1 0 up. Second half, here we go. Jara slips in for Murray pulls it back for Whitaker. if only Boyle had a couple extra bit of pace he could have gone on the end of that one here come Hearts now building from the back Minklovic Gonzalez or Concalves with a shot corner Minklovic Bera Erkstrand's in there to uh, put him off his shot or header so far, nearly 60 minutes gone. Here comes Hibbs with Ambrose with a free kick. Did I mention that uh, Joey Barton's on the books now of Hibbs? He obviously can't play for another couple of weeks. Here comes Barker. Loses play, but gets it back. Silverka slips in. Boyle, Murray had a golden opportunity to tuck that one away, but he doesn't. Look at my bench. Is it is it a time? Is it time for the big M to come on? Or Stokes? Or this youngster Shaw to become a instant hero? We'll see. Ajara. Barker. Crosses it in there. Hamilton clicks that quite easily. So this could be a Hearts attack. And it is. Here comes Wright. Martin. Walker. Players in the box. Headed clear. Miklovic has a shot, but Landlaw saves. Ajara is injured. McGouch, McGill is coming on. And I'm going to go with Young Shaw to be hero of the hour. Can he do it? He's got 20 minutes to shine. Whatever's on the pitch is on the pitch. Free kick to Ambrose. Hamilton tips it over for a corner. Hibbs trying to find something in the last 10, 15 minutes here. Creeping towards the last 10 minutes. Ambrose with another yellow. It's fifth of the season. 10 minutes to go. Free kick for Hearts. Walker. Picks that right. Goncalves has a shot. Pretty wide. Keeper stretches for it though. Last five minutes of the match. Hibbs now. Trying to find it but no. Here come Hearts with a counter. Over the top. Goncalves. Walker, keepers off his line, but Hibbs eventually clear it. And we're streaking into the last couple of minutes. Is there going to be a hero for either side? Here comes right. Minklovic, that shot is poor. Four minutes of injury time. Smith, Cowie. Ladlaw runs off his line and collects the ball. Can he do a good delivery for Hibbs? No, he cannot. Here come Hearts, right at the death. Headed clear, sure. Showing his inexperience up front. 
but we've got to stick with it. Cowie, clears. We have an injury. I have no options now. We are out of subs. Let's play for 10 minutes in the last few seconds. Whitaker, kind of trying to waste some time, I guess. I'll take this point. This point is good. Oh, my days. They nearly snatched it right at the death. Can we hang on this last 10, 15 seconds or so? A little cheeky bit of play there by Ladlaw. And it's over. I would be the happier of the two managers, I believe. Yet to lose the hearts. Our second match of this video is up against Kilmarnock. Kilmarnock currently find themselves in seventh. Where we are sixth. A win could mathematically get us to fourth. So the starting lineup for this match is Marciano, Whitaker, Hanlon, Urshan, Ambrose. McGinn, McTomley, Ijara, Stokes, Swanson, and Murray up front. Match against Kilmarnock. 4-4-2. Let's do it, folks. We get the match underway. It's been a while since a, a commanding performance by Hibbs, so could this be the match? Burke with a free kick, blocked. Here come Hibbs now with Murray. Man in the middle. He's brought down, but uh, considered a fair tackle. And Kilmarnock clean up. Kilmarnock with Gordon Greer, the centre of the defence, former Rover. Uh, Boyd on the bench as well. Tidy couple of players that might be in their later years, but still handy to have at this level. Shots blocked. Here come Hibbs. Swanson. Murray is again tackled by Greer. Bell has it for Kilmarnock. It's cleared now. Here comes Murray once again. Holding up play. Ajara looking for something. McTomney spots Swanson. He's brought down. It's going to be a penalty. It's going to be a penalty. And Swanson will take it. Oh, days. Straight down the middle. Third goal of the season. <sighs> Pow. I'm glad he was confident because I was not. Murray has it once again. McTomney. Ajara spots Whitaker. Back to Ajara. Murray with a snapshot doesn't really uh, trouble anybody except for just the the guys in the crowd here come Kilmarnock Dicker now from a throw in back to O'Donnell crosses it in there Marciano collects so that's right Marciano's back in between the sticks after Ladlaw's stint McTomney now to Whitaker. McTomney the slow patient build up Stokes Murray with a shot just give me a goal kick Celtic now currently top the table by two points. Here comes Kilmarnock with a throw in. McGinn breaks into play and here come Hibbs. Murray dancing and prancing around but he loses it. Here come Kilmarnock. Irwin, Dicker, Jones crosses spots Burke out right. Crosses it in there. Good effort but Marciano well to save that one. He boots it towards Stokes who's not really had a good season if I'm honest. McTomney, Murray, Ajara slips in for Swanson. Crosses it in there. Ajara's in there to tap it home. 2-0. Bit of a bit of a messy play in the middle of the box, but he got his final foot onto it. So 2-0. Um, confident now a little bit. Passionate. Very happy with things are going. Keep it going. Let's keep going. Let's see if we can get any more goals. Try and get our goal difference a lot more healthier because right now it's only a plus two. Next match will be a cup game against Falkirk, so I might mix it up a little bit. 66 minutes gone. Let's make some changes. And Boyle for Swanson. Three subs. No pressure. Have fun. Go, go, uh, go kick a ball about. Here come Kilmarnock now. Trying to make this last 10 minutes a little bit more interesting. But it's cleaned up by Stevens who boots it towards uh, Greer now. Here come Kilmarnock again. And they're not done. But that effort was uh, pretty ambitious. Here they come once more. Throw in. Tackled. Ambrose heads it clear. Dicker with a shot. It looked like it took a deflection, but no. Last five minutes. Can Hibbs just ride this out? Here comes McTomney. Stevenson to Ajara. But Murphy finding his chances few and far between these days. As I try to, I'm just trying to make make do at the moment. And that's the final whistle. So we're going to wrap this baby up with the last game, which is a cup game against Falkirk. So. At the end of it, regardless of what happens, we'll be fourth. Correct? Correct. In the final game of this video, we take on Falkirk at their place. Uh, Falkirk currently are ninth in the Scottish Championship. So 
realistically we should be going into this to, to, to take a win. But I'm going to mix it up a bit and play some uh, fringe players. So the lineup, Ladlow and Goal, Stevenson, Bartley, Ambrose, Gray, McGinn, Rimanotta, McTomney, Galantes, Barker and Hepburn Murphy. Galantis from my youth setup. So our hosts are going in with a 4-2-3-1 formation. And indeed, Falkirk are a capable side. Let's get this match underway. Pepper Murphy, Riminotta. Two of my loanies not really gelled or not really given the opportunity to shine thus far. So we'll see how they play up against the championship, Scottish championship side. But here come Falkirk. Already putting us to our paces. And uh, it we have a... Decent defense here. It's not too weakened. Barker crosses. Riminotta with a snapshot. It'll be a corner. So there's only a couple areas that are weakened. So we should have enough to get over the line. But here comes Falco from a botched corner. And their shot doesn't trouble Ladlaw. Hearts already 1-0 uh, up against Lithingo Rose. But here comes Falco trying to cause the upset. McGee, Harris now, Muirhead, Cragen, oh, makes Ladlow stretch and come out of his area a little bit, but uh, we get away with it. Here come Falkirk once more, they are taking this opportunity to really give us a go. Ladlow, casually as you like to Ambrose, Hepburn Murphy with his pace, not fast enough. But here come Falkirk, Cragen, Harris, tries to cross in there, Bartley clears and Hepburn Murphy now with pace. Oh, he did all the hard work, but couldn't get it in the back of the net. And another effort. He's getting the opportunities today, but here come Falco. Are they going to make better of their opportunities? That shot's a bit wide. Um, they've got more possession. Oh, corner, header, saved by Ladlaw. Stevenson, McGinn, Stevenson. Oh, cheeky effort. Some, I think it was hit by Murphy again. Keeper stretched. Ambrose, Barker with an effort, goes up and over. Looking at my bench, McGinn. Barker keeps it in play though. Bartley, who's, I think, playing at his contract. Second half. I do have some experienced members on the bench too that could come in and dig us out of a hole if we need to. Hepburn Murphy, Stevenson, loses it. Here come Falco, but no, Bartley gets it. Again, we drop possession and now it's Falco uh, Loy with a good effort one on one with Keeper Foster's a corner plays it wide Harris wow good effort Ladlaw collects um Ruminosa still full of beans he can he can offer a bit more surely but here come Falco Cragen don't know his name but he crosses it into Harris as a header and it's all Falco at the moment can we get a better of them you know, we should be there a championship side. McGinn heads it only as far as Harris, Kerr, Taiwo, Craig and Harris. A lot of interchange. There he is, Hippolyte, uh, with the 1-0 one up. One, oh dear. And we are attacking already, so I'm going to have to do something to, to, you know, this could be an embarrassment. Uh, I'm going to throw you on, son. Hibbs, corner. Gray. McGinn. Oh, Galantes in there. That'll be his final bit of action as we shock everything at him now, I think. Overload. McGill. Over the top. Patton. Could have been a hero. Gray. We are in now. Overload. Stevenson. McGill. McGinn. Rocket of a, of a shot, but at the minute we are going out of the cup, which is absolutely dismal. 15 minutes to go. Pressure mounts. Gray. Long throw. McGow to Stokes. To Patton. Look at the pace on that fella. Good effort by the kid. Big kick out by Falco Keeper. Deloy. Second goal would really wrap it up. 10 minutes to go. Hibbs staring at defeat and exit of the Scottish Cup at the first first flipping match, which is miserable. 
Uh, what to do in the final chunk? Stokes. We're gonna go like this. We're gonna really ram it down their throats. Five men up front. Vance forward. Vance forward. Go. Last four minutes. Two at the back. Five in, uh, in midfield. Gray. McGinn. Stokes. Patton with an effort. That's two decent efforts for the, for the boy. Gray. Miguel. Ain't going to get that one. It'll be a cheeky corner. Gray. McGinn. Gasparato, Ambrose will collect this one to Gray, loses it, and here come Falkirk, boots it down there, and a bit, of a bit of a mess in the middle of the park, who's going to get control of the game, it looks like Falkirk, two defenders for Hibs, and that was piss poor considering the, our cup destiny is on the, on the line here, Gray with a monster tackle, and it will be Falkirk to probably see the game out. McTomney boots it. Barker, Stokes, Barker, play it. Somebody get on the end of it. Dismal, absolutely dismal. Well, that's your lot, folks. Pretty dismal end to the uh, video. Obviously, we did pick up a, a nice point in the in Edinburgh Derby up against Hearts, and then we did pick up a comfortable win against Kilmarnock, but that sloppy result against Falkirk costs us possible entry into Europe through the back door but well the next video is going to be an absolute belter three away games two pretty nasty ones uh and the most important one we're going to take on dundee at their place before we might as well spend the night going to glasgow taking on celtic and then rangers join me for that bad boy as uh, our destiny could be decided after these two after these three games glory on the rhine featuring shalcom nulfia and reach for the summit featuring Real Sociedad. Until next time, thumbs up, subscribe, ciao for now.